Hello everyone. I plugged my mic in so hopefully you can't hear the construction going on. I'm sorry if you can and also that. But anyway, um, so I heard about Bernard Taylor last night either while I was working or between working. Um, and I can't say I'm surprised. I'm not even shocked by what our justice system has done because our justice system isn't about justice it's not it's not for us it's not and it's not even just about being black at this point um with boys like lyndon cameron and the similar incident of a person being killed with um with mental health issues daniel prude the thing about daniel prude and lyndon cameron is that they both have mental health issues um but Lyndon, I don't know Lyndon's condition, whereas Daniel is already very dead. Um, it's like, it's the in-club oligarchy. Like, if you're not in the in-club, you're not going to get anything. Um, and they made the in-club very difficult to get to. Um, because college costs an arm and a leg, and you're really not in the in-club if you're not a judge or a lawyer or whatever, so... Um, I didn't go to the protest last night, but I know that protests will be ongoing. But I'm saving my energy for what's possibly going to happen with George Floyd because I feel like something similar is going to happen. Um, because shenanigans have already started with George Floyd. But uh, I, I just feel so many things. It's like... I'm so terrified by this whole justice system. And at the same time, I'm so inspired and embraced by, by the community, the community all over the world, not just here. Um, thank y'all for all your love and support. Thank y'all for being out there. Thank y'all for going hard for Breonna Taylor. Um, my condolences to Beyonce Taylor's family. I hope y'all take that $12 million and get the fuck out of this shit whole country. Um, and I, I hope, I, I hope that healing comes to Louisville, but I hope that that healing can come from justice. And I hope that we, can, we do whatever it takes to get that justice. If we gotta dismantle democracy and start over, let's do that. We need to do whatever it takes, by any means necessary, to get what everyone deserves, which is basically the right to live. That's all for this one. Y'all take care.